So hello friends, you can see here that we have a pH meter. So normally pH is going to tell you what is acidity or basicity of the sample, water sample. Okay. So now what we have to do, first of all, uh, before going into detail about the pH meter, we should know what is a pH meter, what it does and how it works. So we have two different kinds of, I mean like pH meter here you can see one is, the one is called SWOT and the other one is from the hack. So normally the uh, the first one is a, just a pH meter. Okay, it can also behave like a multimeter. So it can behave as a conductivity meter as well as DO meter as well as a pH meter. So you can see here at the back there are some uh, any I mean like points where you can change uh, the probe. Okay, so if you change the probe, let's suppose the pH put a pH probe, so it will behave like a pH meter and this one if you change the probe I mean like put just this is a conductivity meter probe and this is a pH probe here normally in the pH meters we have to put certain kind of solution so you cannot put acid or base so you have to put specific kind of uh, solutions so normally we can use uh, an electrolyte or we can use pH 4 or pH 7 by 4 so you don't have to put a distal water or deionized water in this way if you put distal or deionized water in that case the probe will be I mean like it will not be operational not be working uh, how to measure so first of all you have to make sure your I mean like the equipment is calibrated for that you have to I mean like first of all for the first one you have to put the mo mode press the cal button you can see here that for calibration you need three buffers so seven four and ten we have to do first of all we have to i mean like open this probe gently okay so now we'll be opening this probe here i have opened the probe okay now i will clean this probe with uh, dis distal water or deionized water I hope you all know what is a buffer buffer is normally a kind of a solution that is comprised of weak acid strong base or strong base weak acid or you can say strong acid weak base and it does not resist a change in the pH so now I'll press cal so now you can see
watching don't forget to subscribe and like mine